Good evening everyone, this is Toxic Ghost Philippines giving you your top leaner and loser analysis for April 21, 2017. This is not a stock recommendation, we encourage you to consider your own financial goals, investment horizon, and risk tolerance when you make an investment decision. We cover the top 5 gainers and losers in the premium version of this report. Please visit www.stocksignals.ph services to learn more about our services. Okay, for April 21, uh, your top gainer is Kev, but it doesn't have volume. MacK doesn't have volume. BM doesn't have volume. So the next one will be MRC up 11.76% with a value of 215 million. <laughs> Technically, I think it hit our estimated resistance. Ah, it's above. Our expected resistance was 0 0.37, but it was able to move higher. Our next expected resistance is around... Ah, we haven't charted it yet. Okay, let's use the monthly rather so that it will be easier. Okay, so based on the monthly, your next resistance would be around 0 0.415. So that will be our expected resistance. Support is at 0 0.38 followed by 0 0.34. Moving averages are still trending bullishly. 200 SMA is now below the price, which uh, in which this may act as support. That's based on the monthly. Based on the daily, uh, they really are bullishly aligned. Uh, volume is also good. Actually, the volume today was very, very high. I just told you it's an all-time high. Let me see. Let's draw a horizontal line there. Ah, it's moving also. But so far, for 2016, I think that would be an all-time high. 2015, yeah. Well, we're still at all-time highs. Okay. Uh, MACD is trending in a bullish manner. RSI is also bullish in nature. It's overbought, but it's just natural given the nature of a highly trending stock. Uh, fundamentally, again, we have seen this before, the stock has nothing. But uh, it's trading at 3.15 times price to book value. That's the only good thing about it. So it's not yet, well, it's still overvalued, but not that high. Okay, let's go to the top loser, OPM. But it doesn't have volume, API as well, MVC, no volume, so it's gonna be APL down 4.35%. APL. Let's look at the fundamentals first. Here. Well, it has negative earnings, so never mind. Price to book value is also absurdly very, very low, so I wouldn't. I would take this with a grain of salt right now. Uh, anyhow. Oops. APL technically, okay. Okay, wait. There we go. Mm -hmm. It's still short term bearish as, our, uh, as the 15 and 20 SMA are acting as resistance. 50 SMA, 200 SMA, if the stock starts a bullish trend, would still act as resistance. Uh, uh, volume is still relatively thin to warrant a conviction, but our estimated support is at 0 0.43, our resistance at 0 0.048. MACD has made a bullish crossover, but is now poised for a bearish crossover. RSI pointing downwards, not oversold yet, so it still has room to move lower. If the stock doesn't hold its support, its next target would be 0 
fundamentally uh, yeah we'll discuss this already okay so that was your top linear and loser analysis for april 21 2017 again this is not a stock recommendation we encourage you to consider your own financial goals investment horizon and risk tolerance when you make an investment decision we cover the top five winners and losers in the premium version of this report so please visit www.stocksignals.ph slash services to learn more about our services thank you for watching and have a wonderful weekend everyone